What is up, everybody? It's your boy Daniel's Vlogs here. How y'all doing today? I know, I know. It's been about a month since I made a video, and I apologize about that. But good things come at the end. Today, I am doing an unboxing video, and this time it's not a G Fuel video for once. Um, this is a new headset that I got just a few days ago. I haven't opened it yet. I was waiting to uh, make the right time to make this video, and now is a good time. Um, today, I am unboxing the uh, Razer Black Shark V2X wired, that's right, wired headset, and I got this in, uh, the other day, it was on sale, so I had to grab it, because I'm a big Razer fan, I don't have much Razer stuff at all, or none of except for this, um, but yeah, I can't wait to unbox this, now remember, it's not the wireless one, the wireless one I was going to get was not on Xbox as well for PC, PlayStation, and Switch. So this wired one is for Xbox, as you can tell by the logo right down here. It's the little Xbox logo right there. And we're just gonna go ahead and jump into this. I have not done an unboxing video of a headset since I got these Steel Series like a few years ago. I'll put a link down to the in the description if you guys want to check out this unboxing video of my awesome Steel Series that I still have to this day, and I use it for PC over here. So let's get it. Anyway, guys, so I got the camera zoomed in on me a little bit better so you can see the box better. Um, got myself my cool knife right here. And before I open it, I'll just go over the box a little bit. Um, right here is the front. Um, obviously, that's the front of the box. Little razor -like, like logo right up here. And then on this side, um, it shows what this all has. It, it, all the, like, let's say the clans have used, like you got Optic, DRX versus, yeah, here it is. Experience the unfair advantage used by some of the world's best esports athletes. Compete in the big leagues with gear designed with and trusted by Team Razor. So on the bottom right here, it shows Optic, DRX, V5, Mouse, Gentle Mates, uh, Mandatory, and Edward Gaming. These are all the guys that use this same headset. Um, and right here on the bottom right here, it says design four, design four, Xbox Series XS and Xbox One and Windows 10 and 11. Now I have the Series S, um, one terabyte that came out a few years ago, I mean last year, and, uh, that's what this is. And then on the back, it shows what the, all the features it has. Um, it has advanced passive noise cancellation for my neighbors that love to be so loud. They drive by blasting their music at like... 2 o'clock in the morning, I'm trying to play games I can't focus because they're so loud. Um, that cancels that out. Um, it also has cross-platform compatibility, which is good. Um, it also has Razer Triforce 50mm drivers. Awesome, awesome. Um, lightweight design with memory foam, ear cushions, um, 3.5mm analog connection, and lastly, last but not least, a Razer HyperClear mic. So you're, when you're talking to somebody on the when you're playing your friends or something, it doesn't sound like it doesn't sound like <laughs> and that's what's cool about it. And then right here, another icon that shows Razor right here, pretty cool. Um, and yeah, that's basically it. All right, so actually, I might not need this knife. This is actually one of those peel offs that you just peel it right off. And there we go. You just peel it right off like that, and boom. So. That was pretty easy. All right, let's, so we got that off. We're going to pop this open and take a look inside. Yeah, that's a tough box, ain't it? There we go. All righty. So we have the first thing that we get welcomed with is looks like a booklet for it. So that's pretty cool. Um, and then we got to pull it out like this because it's kind of the way it is. Um, Beautiful sound. Listen to that. Oh man, is there anything else in here? Nope, nothing else in there. Just an empty box. So I'll put this box right down here. And then we're going to go ahead and move this stuff around here. Okay, so here we go. We're going to go ahead and just do it like this. We're going to grab it right up here. Easily pull it out like that. And we got some stuff in here that it came with a foam that protected it, which is really cool. And I believe that's everything, really. I think this is just the piece for it and like that protected it. And then this right here. The cord might be in there. Might be in this one right here. 
Nope, nothing. So that's just an empty box now. But now we got the headset right here. And here it comes, nice and slow. Beautiful. Wow. Oh, nice. It came with a, a case I can carry it around with me. Nice. Cool. And here it is, guys. The wire's right here. And the microphone. Easy to take off. There's the microphone. What the axe? See that little microphone? And then this is a wired that's plugged into the controller. I mean, I've always been a fan of wired headsets. I mean, I like my Bluetooth. I still have my Bluetooth Turtle Beach, but I just thought I'd give myself like a new wired headset just in case like my Bluetooth headset dies and I can use this um, to play. Um, but here is the wire. It's all wrapped up. I'm going to put this on my head. And there we go. That's basically it, guys. Really all it is. Um, I love this, the, the design. It feels good. I love the foam. And I can't wait to try this out. Okay, so I opened up the instruction booklet. That's what this is. It shows how to turn the volume down on it and everything. Um, and I get a surprise with it. I got me some stickers with it that came out of the packet, which is some cool stickers. Um, I want to say it's a surprise. I mean, it was, I kind of knew it was probably going to be there anyway, inside the booklet anyway. But I really do like this sticker. And I did find the foam mic thing that goes right here, the little, the little whatever this is, what do they call that? It's like an anti-wind. Uh... Yeah, it's like an anti-wind thing. And that's what this is for, and I found it. I had a bright part there, guys. I have not had caffeine today yet. But, yeah, so I found this. So that stays on when I'm talking. Um, I really like the, the feel. It feels amazing. Um, it just, I can't wait to try this when I game later. I got stuff to do today, but I got myself the razor. Feels good on my head. Um, I, the volume button is right here. My fingers are right there. You guys can see it right there. And the mute button is this little button right down here in the bottom. So, yeah, it's pretty cool. It feels good. I love the feel of it, and I can't wait to try it. There's one thing I want to show you guys before I end the video, and um, this is the carry case I came with. I love this carry case because um, I, I usually do some traveling, and I like to bring my games with me when I travel, so this is perfect to carry my headset in. Um, and I'm super pumped to have this to help me carry it. It came with the box. Um, and the stickers are cool. What do you guys think? Do you think I should put a sticker on the case or should I not? Let me know. Um, but yeah, guys, that's basically it for the unboxing. Um, really don't got nothing really to say right now. Nothing really new has been going on. Um, just been trying to get more videos out for you. Coming up with some good ideas for some videos. Um... But, yeah, that's basically it, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Um, kind of thought I'd make this one a little short because it was just an unboxing of a headset. Um, I will be trying this headset out, and I'll be doing a follow-up video on it and let you guys know how it sounds. I'm sure a lot of you have had this headset before. Some of you have not. Um, but, uh, yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. And like I said, um, I will be looking for the... Uh, video that I got when I got the Steel Series. I haven't used these a lot. I only use it for when I'm on my laptop to play. Um, but I will be putting a link down in the description down below about this headset when I first got it. And uh, let you guys check out that video too. But um, I do got a special announcement. I have an idea for an ASMR video coming up really soon. Um, so be on the lookout for that. Um, and it's gonna be an actual ASMR. And I know, I know, I normally joke around and be like, mm, "That's good" or whatever. But I'm actually gonna make it like an actual like ASMR for y'all coming soon. Um, if you guys want to check out my last ASMR video I did like almost a year ago, link down in the description as well for that. And, and I'll also put a link down in the description for my most views on an ASMR video. And that was just a G Feel video that I did with an ASMR. So I'll put a link down there as well. Um, but, uh, yeah, guys, so be on the lookout for that. Got some cool ideas for y'all coming soon. I really miss doing the ASMR videos. Sorry I haven't posted. Like I told you guys a month ago in my last video, I said I was taking some time after that video to come up with more video ideas for y'all. Um, there will also be a description for last month's video down in the description down below if you guys want to check it out. Um, only got seven views on it, so I guess a lot of people didn't, wasn't crazy for the video. But I also put a link down in the description so you guys can check that out as well. But um, anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys have a great day, and I really hope you guys have a great Labor Day. Enjoy your three-day uh, weekend for y'all, 
and I will see you guys in my next video. Peace. Peace.